different in Jesus Christ and uh, when you see these days has been an important days and uh, we, be we began to listen to the gospel of the day readings and we participate in the Eucharistic celebration and uh, how far uh, our faith is grown how far uh, we have grown in our faith how far we have strengthened our faith and these are the things you know dear friends we need to be conscious of conscious of uh, rather it's better that it's good that you have an examination of conscience at the end of the day recalling the day day's activity your thoughts your words your deeds what you have done you know so remember uh, when you see somebody when you are listening to a talk or speech or a lecture or seminar you don't you may not be expecting or you don't like to listen to the same talk you may, you may not like to listen to the same talk, but, but obviously you may like to listen to the same talk if it is well said, well addressed by a particular person whom you are uh, inspired of, uh, on who, uh, whom you are inspired of. Uh, so therefore, dear friends, but and then uh, people look for something new, something new, new reflections, new words, new thoughts. Uh, they want to be fed with the new thoughts, you know. But uh, regarding the food, when you see food, people like certain food, they like very much biryani or parotta. Parotta, people like certain food and they are ready to take it even every day. They may not be fed up of eating the same food because they like it, pizza, burger and so on, etc. So coming to the gospel of today. So today Jesus is healing the blind man. So if Jesus is healing the blind man, so with another miracle, uh, Jesus, is, um, uh, Jesus is telling the process of faith. So he is healing the blind man uh, with the two stages, uh, with, the, with the two stages, in two stages. And that clearly shows us the, uh, the faith or the faith of uh, that we have uh, does not does not you know get the instantaneous uh, result instantaneous result because we need to grow in faith step by step you know so slowly he was touching the eyes and then he was spitting on his eyes and uh, spitting and then uh, he got the sight step by step step by step so therefore dear friends we also need to see that so before healing the blind man, he took him outside the village. He took him out of the village and there he was healing his sight. So from this, you know, dear friends, we need to discover that we need to come out of ourselves, come out of our, come out of the noisy world, space and time to listen to the word of God, to listen to the voice of God. So we need to keep up this in our mind, dear friends. So as Jesus took the blind man out of the out of the village, let us come out of ourselves and listen to the words of Jesus in our day-to-day -day life. And that we will grow in faith. So therefore, dear friends, let us practice this in our day-to-day -day life. Come out of yourself and listen to the voice of God. Thank you.